moments of joy and color in her life are her daughter more than she guiding her daughter it's her daughter who holds her little finger and guides her all along her daughter is her guardian angel over to you good evening toast masters <coughs> today i'll be presenting how to conquer the cold call now what is a cold call is it a sales speech is it that i need to go there bombard the client with my product or is it a interaction between the buyer and the seller on a very very subtle notes when it comes to cold calling what do i know as a seller about the buyer you can say absolutely nothing the only chance the only information that you have is that it might be a potential sale nothing more nothing less usually cold calls happen because we google for potential clients leads from people from our network from our friends and especially when it is a cold call regarding an expensive product the decision for the buyer itself is so long drawn that you do not expect to make a sale in cold call in the first instance the only thing you can do is generate some interest for your product get to know your client better and see how you can make that potential of making a sale into a real conversion how can you make that client think of you next time that he makes that buying decision how does that client puts you in the forefront say that yes i need this and maybe this is someone i can look forward to to make that decision happen so today we are going to enact here a 5 minute skit wherein i will be representing the seller making a cold call to a potential buyer what do i know about the buyer well he is a director of a financial institution he is the one who makes decisions in terms of what corporate identity they need to convey to their customers in terms of giveaways gifts to enhance their corporate identity when it comes to corporate gifts and specifically in an expensive category for a financial institution we are looking at something around 2000 to 4000 dirhams bracket and when it is multiplied into about 400 to 500 pieces i don't have to do the math right it is a risk the person who is going to take that decision and say okay we are going in for this product so let's begin to tell you something little more about this call that i'm going to make today i have been hankering behind the director for the past 2 months just to get one appointment and this is one call that i need to make right now Balaji, this is Anupama from Fortune Company. Can I take you a few minutes? Hi, Anupama. I've been very busy, Anu. I don't know how I can get back to you. I think you asked me to call you back, but I've been very busy and I'm not free today. Ah, uh, just five minutes of your time will be enough for me to present my company credentials. Okay, what time are you coming up? Ah, uh, at your convenience. Can you make it now? Five minutes you get. I got more than that. Please. Thank you very much. Yeah, that's it. I got a appointment. And now it's to the office of Mr. Balaji at his corporate head office.
Thank you. Thank you very much. You know you have about five minutes, right? Absolutely. Thank you. Uh, this is my car. Okay. Mr. Banerjee, your reference has been given to me by Mr. Shashi. Okay. I know Mr. Shashi is a very good friend of yours. And in fact, one day I complimented him on the watch he was wearing. And he said, it has been gifted by Mr. Balaji of ABC. I would just let you know, is it your decision to make that gift? Yeah, it's my decision. I should really compliment you. You have a very good taste in watches. A rattle with a black dial, actually it enhances what your company philosophy is. Wonderful gift, I should say. Can I ask you one more question? How do you make this decisions in corporate gifts? When it comes to corporate gifts, the first thing we do is, should I give, should I not give? Yes. And to whom should I give? Okay. Is that person worth for the organization? And more importantly, I need an organization to be on the spot. I don't want a rag to be so big so that my organization logo is not coming over there. So when I give it, it's my organization first, and rag comes later. So if you have a look at Tracy's watch, you will find that the logo of my organization is bigger than the rag. Yes, I did find it. It was in sync with what your philosophy of the company is. And it was so evident in his hand that at one glance, I saw it there. You have three minutes to Absolutely, sir. I know that. In fact, if I give you something that is similar to your organizational philosophy, would you be interested? Sure, please, you have it. And then we'll discuss. I have something for you.
small scenario wherein I tried to convince the client that my product was worth for him to consider. Now I would like to know from the audience what would have been done better in this skit. You have two to three minutes to give me that feedback. Anybody? I'm not asking my evaluator. I need to come I need this to come from me. I don't know. I can't. <laughs> this to come from the audience. Yes, Mr. Omesh. You need to be convincing the customer that you really have references from some clients. Because this market is full of manufacturers like you coming and disappearing overnight. They give good good sales talk, they take the order and then they're gone. I have this in mind. Anybody else? Like you are coming and talking to the director and straight away praising about the company and the decision and the product which he has chosen is fine. Yeah. You could have another round of general conversation so that the concentration or the focus is not on the sales type but you have a different interest in life also and then bring it back again to the conversation of your product. Yes. Uh, I mentioned about the market and the product. Yes. Uh, really and the director didn't ask about the quality of the product, the history, all those things. Right? So based on that, the patient has to be. You can say, uh, this is the company, this is the company, this is the company. Uh, I assume you're trying to communicate that this is the manufacturer of the product, not the agent of the product. Yeah, I said that. But the this is the company, this is the company, this is the company. Uh, that didn't uh, communicate that. 